Hello everybody, Gowner here with the team for the Abyss, the Anniversary of Abyss Lufenia. I am bringing Lightning, Balthier, and Amid Italian. This is exactly the same as Beatrix's LC, except I think there's less HP all around and you have to have the uh, requirements, the characters and whatnot. I would like to say, uh, yeah, there is already a video of this exact same team composition already out there. The only difference is uh, my Baldir does not have the LD passive equipped. And uh, either way, it's still not that big of a deal. Oh, I should have used Sephiroth's column, Baldir. Yeah, because I figured if they're going to copy and paste the fight, I'll just, I'll just use the exact same team. Pretty convenient that it fit all the crystal color requirements and stuff. Yeah, I really wish they tried something different. They at least came up with their own Lefenia for, for the anniversary. Or at least if they were going to pick a Lefenia to copy, just not my least favorite one in recent memory. I mean, yeah, I forgot about the trio that was, uh, that was crazy hard, but those are just hard. This one felt like it did not want you to deal with the mechanics at all, and I find that kind of annoying. So I'm just not dealing with it. On the bright side, at least lightning is just carving through them. And I bet this would have gone a lot faster if I had Baldur's LD equipped. I mean, I do have it. I got it. I was prepared to pity for it because I set aside stuff for the global first, but, uh, yeah, I haven't gotten to play around with it much. In fact, he's still level, like, 70. Well, he's, like, 75, 70. So, unfortunately, I can't even give you my thoughts on him. But at least on paper, he sounds really nice. Let me see here. I will delete B, I guess. And that just means, I mean, A, just need to hit A with the army of one. Even the thresholds are exactly the same on this fight. I'm assuming because it's just so strictly similar, I'm assuming that the, all the mechanics are the same, like the recast is the total AoE HP. I didn't even read it because I was kind of worried it was going to be the same fight, and I was right. Let's see here. Group magic, total HP, plus group. Yeah, this is, yeah, it's the exact same. Yeah, that's unfortunate. Honestly, the way things are going, I was kind of thinking it was going to be like, um, against the colorless queen, maybe. Oh, duh, I have to serious use as his uh, weapon skin. <laughs> Forgot about that. Alright, let me see. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna... Get them under the threshold very soon. This might do it, actually. Okay, just about. Oh, and I gotta use her LD soon. Ah, dang it, Lightning, I did not want you to jump up. Oh yeah, another difference between this fight and the original, you can't use a friend unit. Uh, 
Okay, what else? Guess I'll just... Yeah, fires of war. Alright, gonna use her LD. Okay, so I'm gonna hit B with all these, then delay A with the army of one. Oh, whoops, that was a launch. Alright, yeah, not that the team is particularly in any danger, but I guess I'll just get the regen effect going to make it stronger. That's a free turn. Yeesh. This is kind of feeling like a slug. Like, I mean, <laughs> the issue is the way I'm going about it is I'm not really in any danger of getting hurt all too much, but the issue is, is if I try to engage with them in any way, like if I let them get a turn, they're probably just going to do that. I remember that they do like a really strong single target attack. And basically, it's very hard to live through it. Yeah, even like ignoring all the restrictions of of like the crystal requirements, even in the, like the original fight, it was pretty difficult to uh to just simply survive without Beatrix. She all crystal. I mean, I'm guessing she would work well for this. I'd hope so. Alright. Also, since I am fresh off my first attempt at this, I used Lightning's Burst just to get this... Honestly, just to get this over with, but, uh... For the sake of this, I'll try not to use it unless I really absolutely need to. I don't know how close Lightning is to her EX, so I'll just do the last one. And if I get into an emergency, that's what the summon is for. Let me think. Okay. Do this. Into Spark Strike. And I'll keep hitting B, and I'll leave A to Amy. last turn of Lightning's LD for now. On the bright side, I feel like this is taking less time than a normal Lufenia fight. Okay, so I'm going to... Hit A with... Probably. Oh, okay. Actually, uh, hit B with this. A is going to take the full brunt of the free skills. Ah, no room for lightning resist down. Yeah, that seems right.
All right, uh, it doesn't matter. I'll just use great aim here because they're under the threshold. I'll target B specifically since it's closer. Since this fight is just the exact same. Oh, actually, I am a bit worried about A hitting the sphere, not sphere, orb. Okay, yeah. Okay, come on. That's gonna do the thing. Where are we at? 12 and 4. Still got the summon on deck. That's launch. Yeah, okay. Okay, gonna use Reno's call. So now they're gonna have lightning resist down on them for just the rest of the fight. Guess I'll finally nope. Eh, I can I could have done better. Okay, come on, I just want to get this launch, so please work the way I wanted it to. Perfect. Okay, where am I at now? Five. Alright, Lightning's next turn is going to be her last LD. Going to do Snatch Shot. Yeah, I don't believe Amy can break that, so I'm just going to... Okay, so Flourish of Steel into Spark Strike into EX. 13 and 20. Okay, it's almost over. Oh, and she's getting a free turn after this. I can't tell if this is faster because they actually have less HP or because I'm just used to this fight already. Two of those snatch shots left, so I'm uh, I'm just gonna HP plus till his next turn. Cause I shouldn't be too reckless with them. But then again, I think it's safe to say I'm gonna get a Fires of War in there somewhere. Yeah, case in point. Okay, let me think about this. HP plus Hue. Lightning is going to focus fire B. And you're going to have Amy delete A's turn. Because honestly, at this point, it's it's in the bag. It's just... I just decided I didn't want to do this fight again. <laughs> I would just like something to mix it up.
Although I imagine it's got to be rough because I, I kind of just fell onto this composition. I used Bowser the first time because, well, I'm going to cheese this fight because I don't like it, so I might as well make it interesting. And uh, who'd have thunk that he would have ended up getting the first LD? Which would have made you run through this fight again, but except it wanted you to... Except kind of nudging you towards a Baldir. A lot, because I wanted to use two crystal, yellow crystal characters, a gun character, and a Final Fantasy XII character. Yeah, at least I made this fight, I guess, a little bit softer. And boop. Alright, well that was kind of underwhelming. Hopefully this made the score. I don't see why it wouldn't. Yeah. There's that. Uh, alright. So I'll see you in the next event, which I can't remember what it is. It's like Caius? Yeah, I think it's Caius. So I think I'll see you for that fight.